Welcome back to another episode on Teacher Watchers, a show where we go in full depth on a story behind your favorite guardians. Who knows what truths you will find? What secrets will be unveiled? What do we call ourselves? The Teacher Paparazzi. In today's episode, we find ourselves interviewing none other than our own middle school teacher, Dr. Evie Wusk, child personnel. Hello! So good to... What's your name? My name is Dr. Wusk. Do you have children? <laughs> I have two children. My daughter's name is Charlie, she's three, and my son's name is Oliver, he's one. And they're both crazy and awesome. What child is your favorite? <laughs> my child is my favorite. <laughs> <laughs> Auburn is where my dad is from. He was a farmer growing up, and so it was always like, get stuff done. I think being from Nebraska, you get connected to people more. When I was in high school, the adult women that I saw were making a difference were teachers. I always liked English and I always enjoyed those classes, so I just thought that's on school. That's something I'm going to pursue. I had a back brace when I was in middle school, which I named George and I hated. It made me feel like uh, different, like it didn't fit. I kind of got that feeling of how it's like um, to have people kind of stare at you. And so I think it gave me a lot of empathy and made me care a lot about students, especially in middle school, when it can be kind of like you're not quite sure how you feel in your own skin. I was writing in my journal, because you know I write a lot, and it was a pen from the place. I was writing about the place and I just realized this is not where I want to be, this is not what I want to be doing, I want to be doing something um, that's more focused on these other passions that I have. That was kind of the moment, but usually, as with most decisions in your life, it's sort of a buildup um, that leads you to think, I'm going to try something different. Thanks for watching this video. We encourage you to learn more about your so-called teachers by checking out our other video on your beloved or evil Mrs. Finkel. I hope you got all that subliminal messaging we put in here. Uh-huh.